Hi, today in Cake Craft City we're going to be airbrushing a cake black using the Rainbow Dust Colour Flow Airbrush Colours. I prefer to airbrush cakes black rather than using shop bought black icing because it has a different texture and taste to it. Also as well, the black when you've airbrushed it stays black. It doesn't go grey, it doesn't like lighten, it stays a very very deep vibrant black. Every time I airbrush I always just put a bit of cling film over the turntable to keep it nice and clean. The great thing about the Rainbow Dust Colour Flow airbrush colours is that they actually come with a dropper for the top so therefore you're going to be using the right amount it's not going to be pouring everywhere and you can have real control over how much colour you're actually using so what we're going to do is fill it up and what I tend to do is always keep some kitchen roll to the side and once I've actually put my colour in I practice a little bit to make sure that the colour is coming out smoothly and it's not spluttering. So let's get started. Pulling back and as you can see that's coming out nice and smoothly. So let's start on the cake. So what we're going to be doing is building up the layers of colour. building up the layers and layers of colour. There you go. So as you can see, we're left with a very, very black cake, which will hold its colour. It will not fade, it will not get lighter, it will stay this deep, deep black colour. And as you can see, we put in two and a half millilitres of the colour flow into the pot. And there's still, if you can see, there's still paint colour left in there. So it's a very, very cheap and economical way to colour your cakes. The advantages of using an airbrush to colour a cake is that you can use your favourite icing to cover any cake. You don't have to buy multiple colours of everything. And you know that it will actually hold that colour. And you're not going to have any waste. You're not going to have off bits of all different colours that you keep in your fridge and never actually get used. I hope you've enjoyed watching today's tutorial and if you find this useful please subscribe to our channel and comment down below of any skills that you would like to see us 
demonstrate for you. I'm Lee from Cape Craft City and thanks for watching today's tutorial.